Hi there. I am visiting my aunt Eliza. She is an environmental engineer, and is working at a new construction site. Hi. Thanks for stopping by. As an environmental engineer, I focus a lot of my day on examining the relationship between construction projects and the environment. Today, I have been asked to help with examining ways to reduce the impact of weather-related hazards on houses. That sounds complicated. Don't worry, I can teach you all about it. Let's talk about extreme weather conditions and the hazards they can cause. But don't worry, we'll also show you some housing solutions that can help keep you safe. Let's start with floods. Floods happen when there's too much rain and the water overflows rivers, lakes, and other bodies of water. Floods can be dangerous because they can cause a lot of damage to homes and other buildings. Next up, tornadoes. Tornadoes are massive swirling winds that can cause a lot of destruction in a short amount of time. They can rip roofs off homes, knock down trees, and even flip over cars. Hurricanes are similar to tornadoes, but much larger and last for days. They bring heavy rain and strong winds that can cause a lot of damage to homes and buildings. They're often accompanied by massive storm surges that can flood entire neighborhoods. Finally, earthquakes are sudden movements of the Earth's crust. They can cause buildings to shake and collapse, which can be extremely dangerous for those inside. Yikes! That sounds really scary. Extreme weather can be very dangerous. It can, but one part of my job is to provide solutions to reduce the impact of extreme weather. There are ways to keep yourself safe from extreme weather conditions. One solution is to build a house that's designed to withstand these hazards. For example, a flood-resistant house is designed to keep the water out. It has a raised foundation, flood vents, and materials that can withstand water damage. A tornado-resistant house is built with reinforced walls and a strong foundation. It also has a shelter or safe room where you can go to stay safe during a tornado. A hurricane-resistant house is designed to withstand high winds and storm surges. It has reinforced walls, a strong roof, and impact-resistant windows. Finally, an earthquake-resistant house is built with flexible materials that can bend and sway during an earthquake. It also has a strong foundation that's anchored to the ground. See, there are lots of ways to stay safe during extreme weather conditions. Whether it's a flood, tornado, hurricane, or earthquake, you can protect yourself by building a house that's designed to withstand the hazards. Wow. It's really interesting to see how different housing designs can hold up to extreme weather. Thanks, Ann Eliza. You're welcome.